a demonstration to show the effects of damping caused by magnetic induction on different types of non-magnetic pendulums. This is a flat plate that we can use as a pendulum for our demonstration. The pendulum is allowed to swing. Observe that the pendulum swings easily without much resistance. We connect the AC plug of the adapter to the electrical means. As the adapter is turned on, a direct current passes through the circuit. The iron coil begins to generate a magnetic field which is positioned at the lowest point of oscillation of the pendulum. As the swinging pendulum cuts the constant magnetic field of the iron coils, the pendulum experienced increased damping. The pendulum soon comes to a stop. As the plate enters or leaves the magnetic field, the changing magnetic flux induces currents flowing in the plate. These eddy currents in the plate generate magnetic fields by the plate that causes a magnetic force that always opposes the motion of the plate. That's why the pendulum slows down and comes to a stop. Let's see what happens when we use a different plate. This plate has slots cut into it. Will the damping effect be different on such a plate? Without any magnetic field generated by the coils, the plate with slots swings with little damping from air resistance. As we press this button on the adapter, a direct electric current passes through the circuit. Like before, the iron coils generate a constant magnetic field at the lowest point of oscillation of the pendulum. A damping effect is still present, but this time the plates take a longer time to come to a stop. Why would including slots in the plate make the damping effect less for this plate? Adding the slots in the plate lowers the amount of induced eddy currents passing through the plate. So the magnetic damping experienced by this plate is much reduced. Thus, we can see significantly less damping on this plate.